What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's Jack Segos here, and today is the second episode of the LEGO Morning Talk. Let's get straight into it. Grab your coffee, grab your breakfast, sit down, and enjoy. So first off, we have personal business. As always, uh, this week has been pretty good. We did a, a whatnot live stream on Friday through Saturday morning. Um, I, I started streaming at 7.08 p.m. on Friday, and I went all the way till 12.30 in the morning Saturday. And I really appreciate everybody who was on there. If you want to join whatnot, there'll be links in the description below. Make sure you sign up super worth it the community is awesome on there i really appreciate everybody who joined me on that live stream and um i had such a great time that i just decided to stay up all night and uh package everything there were a couple sets that needed to be taken apart i washed them all um made sure everything was there and uh around 5 30 i was like man i want i'm hungry so i went to biscuitville i grabbed uh the waffle biscuit, which is super good, and uh, iced coffee to keep me awake. So, um, and then I came back, took a one hour nap, so I got one hour of sleep uh, between those two days, and then um, yeah, shipped everything off like on Saturday morning at like eight thirty, and uh, went from there basically. So everything's arriving this week. I got some uh, uh, most of the stuff actually got delivered yesterday on Wednesday, uh, and I got some stuff delivering as well today as well so uh yeah super excited for all that stuff to get delivered and uh really appreciate everybody who stopped by on that whatnot stream super awesome i was able to actually sell my castle shout out to that buyer right there if you're watching this video um it was just sitting on my table and uh yeah i really appreciate that purchase there so actually went to Coles and i picked up another 15 of them which was super cool and i got the box as well the mini 36 carrier box uh so now i have all the boxes the entire series and yeah so if you guys are looking for any specific disney cmfs make sure you leave them down in the comment section below and uh, dm me on instagram if you are interested make sure you follow me on instagram as well jack Segos yt and um yeah next up we have of course brand new sets and new stuff coming around so if you guys haven't already seen the star wars mechs to be honest i like them the met color and like the functionality of it um just looks nice like the bubba fett mech looks really good the colors of the pieces just dude there's something about it it looks good it looks like a great display piece and um they look good like good mechs you know so out of all the mechs like those are really good so and i'm excited to get a darth vader figure a stormtrooper and a bubba fett figure so yeah they'll be up here on the screen for you guys to see let me know your thoughts in the comment section below i would love to hear what you guys think of these we also have on june 1st we have this jurassic park sets coming out which is going to be super awesome make sure you go uh, stop by and grab those from the lego store or legoshop.com um i'm really excited for those jurassic park like the og they're not like legacy you could say but they sort of are like legacy jurassic park from like the first movie so i'm excited to get those sets as well on june 1st all right guys we are on to our of course third part the investing part and um this is gonna be pretty interesting there's a lot of stuff retiring this year and um, if you have already probably watched a lot of other people's uh, investing retiring lists for 2023, once you see those sets and you have the available budget to go out and get those sets, I would do that immediately. Don't wait for the last minute. I know a lot of people say, hey, wait for the last minute. And um, it doesn't work like that because you have a ton of people going out and you might maybe be able to get some. So I would go out right now, get those Ahsoka Brickheads, get those Republic Fighter Tanks, get those Brickheads, Disney, Star Wars, all the Brickheads that are out right now. If you don't remember in 2017, 2018 possibly, those Star Wars and DC Brickheads, they were on Target shelves. When you go to Target right now, there's only the Mando and Child Brickhead. That's it. So every single brickhead that is basically out right now is exclusive to lego so it's not like you're gonna see them at walmart 
they're never going to go on sale. Don't count on it. So, uh, yeah, those are some tips for you guys. Um, yeah, shout out to the Soka Brickhead. I would pick some of those up as soon as possible. Republic Fighter Tanks as well.